Barbara, her you want to send somebody to jail over this evidence right here? I'm not saying this is all the evidence you've got, but this is a gross misrepresentation of the facts. Um. Now, come on. Look, I'm not no, 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 don't paper. plead ignorance now. You came out here. Ignorance. You came out here just standing on these medical records to prove that this man raped your granddaughter with an object, and you said we've got medical proof. Here it is. It says diaper rash, skin tag edema, and hemorrhoids. Sexual abuse. Mm -hmm. It does not say sexual abuse. It doesn't say that. Thank it you. does not say sexual abuse. That's what I thought I read. <laughs> sexual abuse, subsequent sexual abuse. What does that mean? When Her you come into a doctor company. and say, "I'm telling you, this this child has been sexually abused," and they say, "Okay, we assuming that the parent is a reliable historian." In a differential diagnostic process, gotcha. we will list as a consideration that possibility. No, do, no other doctor than the, than the emergency room has looked at her. Th then issue. you don't have medical proof. Emergency room doctor did, and that was the emergency room doctor's he report. Met the emergency room doctor is the one that said it's the skin tag, it could be diaper rash, it could be a lot of things. Right. And we had to get the report. You don't from send somebody to prison over somebody saying, eh, it could be a lot of things. Same person that wrote that was the same person that coached you? And orally, Doc. Anthony, your daughter. Orally. Our daughter. Our daughter tells the truth. You, you want to get in this no, conversation. No, that's a medical con That's a medical issue. I'm not a medical doctor. You really doctor. want to get in this Absolutely conversation? Not. You don't like the way it's going? No, I love the way it's going. <laughs> the is coming out today. Why is my daughter saying these things? What? Why is my daughter saying anything? Well, we'll get to that in a minute. Okay. How do you prove she's moral? You can't. We'll get that. We're, we're, we're going to look at that in a minute. But first, I want to determine whether you have medical proof or whether you don't. That's what we have right now because no other doctor has looked at her, Dr. Phil. We're trying to get her to a pediatric gynecologist. I'm not ever. saying you aren't frustrated by not having medical proof. I'm just saying that you don't have medical proof. We don't have enough. We no, really no. don't. That's right. Okay. Because so, it's not there. I'm sorry. I haven't told you whether I think your daughter has been molested or not. I'm just trying to stick with the facts. You came out with a bold statement. I have irrefutable medical proof that this happened. On examination, you actually don't. Mm 